USA is now on four straight Four Nations Cups, the latest coming with a win over arch rival Canada. Now they are set to do battle yet again. Three game series in February, the first game taking place in my hometown of London, Ontario. Game two on Valentine's Day and the third and final game at Little Caesars Arena. For more information, uh, you can head to Ticketmaster.com and find out how to get tickets. And Amanda Kessel joining us once. She's all basically right. all She's besties, right? I mean, Amanda yeah. Kessel's been on the show now like three times. Yes, she has. And you yeah. know what? We've been keeping track of her life. She was de deciding <laughs> what she was going to do. She's going to live in the city. Now she does live in the city. So welcome back. Thank you. Yes. Are you, I mean, you got, you face Canada all the time. Does it ever get old? Because the fans love it always, but it happens so much. It doesn't. Um, it's so few times that we actually get to play them. It's about four games a year. So to have this series for us, we've been like, we've been hearing little bits and pieces about it, but we're excited. Uh -huh, nice. and, and Little Caesars Arena. I mean, that's a, you're in the, you're in the big building big there. I mean, what do you think about that? Yeah, it's really cool. I think USA Hockey and Hockey Canada coming together did a great job to put this together for us. That'd be awesome. Nice. Oh, I mean, that, we gotta fill that building for that game. Yes. I mean, maybe we, they should just send us there each. They should. Right. I'm happy. I'm oh, ready to go. Why not? I'm, I'm ready. ready to go. That would be I'm awesome. Yeah. Can I ask a question or? Of course. Is that okay? No. Do I have of course. Do I have to <laughs> we lost. What, what do you mean? Segment? What do you think? What do you think? I mean, we'll allow it. Okay. Well, I'm, I'm <laughs> such a big fan of watching your Olympic gold medal win, obviously. Took forever for us that lived in Minnesota, just for the record, time-wise. But are we going to see most of the same players? I know some of the kids are back in college now. They're playing on that team. What's the makeup of the team right now for this series? Yeah, it'll be interesting. The roster hasn't been released, but no college players, which is a small chunk of our team. Right. So we will have some new kids joining us, as will, I think, Canada. Oh, great. So the series so coming thrilling. up in February. Always fun to watch yep. the Americans and Canadians uh, do battle. And you guys have had Canada's number uh, quite a bit over yeah. the last couple of years. Yeah. I'd be remiss to not yeah. mention that, because if it was reversed, I'd probably oh. be talking about it as well. But what's the latest with you? What's going on with you? What are you up to? Uh, just training. I was saying before, I spend most of my time walking to a train, living in the city. <laughs> <laughs> but, you know, PT, workout, going to the rink, everyday job for me. All right, well, of course, we knew we were going to have you on, and we've had you on a couple of times now, so we wanted to have some fun with you. So we went digging on your Instagram account, and we picked out a few yeah. photos, and we just want you to give us the backstory of said photos yeah. in this segment that we are calling <laughs> What's Your Story? What's Your Story? What's Your Story? We are going to start uh, with this photo. You got a one? tennis racket in hand. What's the story behind this one? This is interesting. So this is one of my friends, Freedom. He has a new show on the Tennis Channel. Okay, he nice plug. Yeah, he asked if I would help out with him doing a challenge. So the challenge, we weren't quite sure, and it ended up being he couldn't really stand in the skates, and I'm not as good at tennis. So okay. we kind of had a shootout on the ice with tennis rackets. Really? With tennis rackets? You won? Yep. I uh, heated. Oh, yeah. really? oh, I couldn't okay. get the same power from standing there. We were about, like, hash marks uh -huh. in okay. and just drop it. and. You know he's not here now. You could have just said you won. I know, yeah, but true. I like the honesty. Yeah, I can't I like lie, the honesty. yeah. See, yeah, I, I like the honesty. Um, tennis is sneaky hard, though. The first time I played tennis, I was like, yo, oh. tennis is tough. Oh. All right, how about this one? Sleep No More, have you ever heard of that? I just got filled in about it this morning. Sleep No More. But let's tell the people at home, what is Sleep No More? It's unbelievable. It's kind of like a Broadway show, but interactive. I had no idea what to expect. Like, you go in there, no information, and it's like, multiple levels and you're watching a bunch of different storylines. Okay. You can kind of follow whoever you want to. It was just like mind blowing. You have <laughs> no idea. We both came out and we had all these different stories and like you don't see the same things as your friends. So is it kind of like, um, remember Goosebumps, like choose your own adventure? Is it sort of like that? Yeah. In a way? And so we everybody wears these masks. And Who was in the other mask there? Who was the other person? Uh, my friend Courtney Burke. She plays okay. on the Riveters with me as well. Uh, All right, okay, cool. All right. So this inspired us to play a little game of who wore it better. Uh, <laughs> obviously there's you, and then that is Brian Lawton under that mask. Yeah, wow. That was a Halloween costume, and no, you do not have rights to go on my private accounts <laughs> and pull that stuff. Hey, if Take you post down. it out there, yeah. it's fair game. It is. it is. Yes. My vote goes to Amanda. Just yeah, for the that's a no-brainer. Yeah, exactly. That's a good point. Yeah. Your face is showing. If yeah. for that reason alone, I should win. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's a, diff that's a different game. <laughs> that's a different I should game. win. All right. Well, this game's not over yet. Right, we got another that? one. Okay. How about this one? This is that celebrity golf 
charity event with Elena Deladon. Okay. Um, same agency, so I was invited to that tournament. And thought it was pretty funny. Really cool <laughs> photos of her, so. The comment section Poking of that fun. photo is pretty funny uh, as well, but good form. You had good form. Did you ever play basketball growing up? Or I did not. Like My worst sport, so. <laughs> how about, how yeah. about golf? I did play golf, yeah. Uh, any good? Or better what? at golf, yeah. Okay. Right. Who's better, you or Phil, at golf? I'd have to say him, but there have been times that I've beat him. Oh, oh yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. How does he like want to mix with that one, though? Yeah. Don't worry, the players never watch this show. No one will give Phil a hard time about it. No. <laughs> Never happen. I'm sure he can handle yeah. it. Uh, speaking of Phil, our final photo is this one. Oh, okay. And this is a really nice story behind this one. Yeah, this is great. A great event for us to be a part of. Um, cancer prevention. Um, Phil won a pretty big award, and like he, like he um, his personality, he didn't really tell anybody about it. Uh. I was asked. <laughs> so. This is the most promo I got. Yeah, was on your. Yeah. your Instagram yeah. account, uh, yeah. but so it is shocking. He didn't say much. Huh? I know. So my yeah, parents are crazy. like, "What are you going to?" <laughs> oh, oh and like <laughs> our family could have came. And, yeah, no big but, deal. Don't worry about it. We'll be home later. Yeah. Your parents found out via your Instagram account. No, I'm just kidding. But uh, it is Hockey Fights Cancer Awareness Month in the yes, NHL, it so it was uh, good to see that uh, that timely. was something that happened as well. Absolutely. Well, listen, we got to find your next events that you got coming up. I mean, you got the Riveters games. You got the big se the series coming up. And then we'll be we'll be following you around, so you, you're stuck with oh, us yeah. now. I better be back. You know we have some tradition going on. Yeah, That's we right. do kind of That's a right. little bit. But you gotta win. You gotta win the, the two out of three. I'm not even worried about Canada's. Then we'll okay, come back. Canada's enough. Gone. You're gonna win that, and then we want another uh, another Isabel Cup too. Yes, we do. Oh, right. So right now our uh, uh, team's sitting at the bottom right now. But. Really? What's going on there? That's tough. Time I don't to know. <laughs> It's early, though. It's, it's early. Another conversation. It's early. Yeah, yeah it's okay. still early. Uh, Amanda, always a pleasure. And of course, I'm sure you'll be back in a couple months. It's becoming right. a regular thing. Uh, thanks for coming, though. Thanks, Amanda. Yeah, thank you, guys. Thank you.